About five years ago, I was doing some research into my Y line for genetic genealogy, and I made an unusual discovery. And basically, it turns out that my surname doesn't match most of the other people who have the same surname, historically speaking, like we're talking about going back hundreds of years. And this probably points to a non-paternity event, which is explained on the International Society of Genetic Genealogy Wiki. It's a really good resource and kind of explains the different scenarios that can lead to this. And you know, the, the most common one that people think of when you think of NPEs are illegitimate illegitimate relationships or infidelity, uh, but there's all kinds of other situations ranging from uh, slavery, unofficial adoptions, people have embarrassing surnames they don't want to keep, people's uh, names were anglicized, uh, formal name changes, all kinds of situations, and the uh, ISOG wiki really covers it pretty well. And historically, this is a pretty common scenario. You know, I'm, I'm not the only one that has made this discovery. Something like 1% and between 1% and 4.5% of births, historically speaking, probably were NPEs. 